Thanks for joining us. I'm Brianna Pitts with the WBZ News Update. Our top stories, police investigating an armed robbery at a gas station in Braintree. The manager at the Circle K on Elm Street tells us the suspect was wearing a hoodie and a ski mask and did get away with some cash. Fortunately, no one was hurt. And more than a dozen shell casings found on a high school campus in Danvers. 13 empty shell casings were found inside the boys' bathroom in the stadium area at Essex Technical High School yesterday. It is school vacation. Week, but there were two girls across games and a track meet at the school yesterday. Danvers police are investigating. And Boston police are investigating a possible hate crime in Roxbury. The owners of Black Market in Dudley Square found the phrase White Lives Matter scrawled on the side of their building just days before their spring opening. The group hosts African American vendors and works to help local black businesses grow. The owner says she will not be intimidated and hopes to cover the graffiti with a giant mural. Mayor Walsh says the city is helping to clean up that building. Let's get a check of the forecast now with Barry Burbank. Hey, Barry, it's snowing out there. Yeah, Brianna, it is snowing in many locations. Not every location is getting some yet, but some more snow will be falling through the morning hours and producing nothing more than scattered coatings on some of the colder non-paved surfaces. Just about all the roads should stay in pretty good shape. Now, you get in some of this blue shading from parts of the Worcester Hills, Monadnock region, southern Green Mountains, and into the Berkshires. There may be places in these higher drain locations they get a coating to up to two inches, but that's about it. You'll see s snow on some of the trees and some of the car tops, but overall, that's about the extent of this. It's mixing with a bit of sleet as well. As we watch this move out by 10 or 11 o'clock, you can see the rain going out and the snow going out with it, so there'll be a, a lull for the most part until we get to this afternoon when additional scattered showers will form from another disturbance coming in from the northwest. That, those will be mostly in the form of rain this afternoon, early this evening, but if some of them still stick around this evening, they may turn over to wet snowflakes once again, and we would have uh, just maybe a, another additional coating on some places, but that would be farther northwest of Boston. Then, after we get rid of the precipitation today, we have dry times tomorrow through next Wednesday. There'll be no precipitation all of those days. A mix of clouds and occasionally some sun will pop through not tomorrow with quite a bit of wind. And still breezy on Saturday, but not as windy and still a few clouds around. And then really nice and sunny with much less wind on Sunday. And after that, we're off to the races. 65 to 70 much of next week, at least the first half. Brianna. Looks nice, Barry. Thank you. I'm Brianna Pitts. This has been a WBZ News Update.